What's up, YouTube? My name is Cadet Tech Service Elements, part of the Air Force Division Officer Training Corps. And uh, let's go ahead and get right into it. Um, uh, at first, the first thing first, uh, why I joined her to see was because I wanted to join the military. Uh, and the whole military thing is, uh, is a bit of a mess. Uh, I wanted to get myself hurt. I can't say the actual word that I want to say because YouTube would flag it. But I wanted to get myself hurt. And the reason being is simply because I was going through a breakup. And I thought, I, I, uh, I could go in the military, do my duties, or whatever. And then I realized, oh, hey, wait a minute, I can actually make a good, pretty good career out of it. I checked it out and did some research with the Marine Corps. I was like, you know what? <laughs> Maybe there's a reason why I should join the Marine Corps. So, uh, I did some research with the Marines. And then I, uh, I heard, and then I saw, uh, and then I moved away, and then I realized that there's a dread to see in it. I was like, what is up with these people in uniforms? I don't really want to join that program. I saw these people in uniforms, and they were all in blue. <laughs> I was like, wow, where everybody's in blue. What does that, what's going on here? I finally asked him, hey, so what is it, Jared, to see? I was like, well, hey, can I sign up? And they're like, yeah, sign up, but you can't sign up right now. There's a weight limit and everything. I'm like, great. There's a, there's whole types of limits with Jared, to see. The best thing you want to do, sign up at the beginning of the year. And uh, that's what I did. It took me... It took me five to six years to get in Jersey C. Um, and I'm not joking, it took me that long. Um, and it wasn't because it was a process, it's that my parents thought it was going to be the actual military and they didn't want me uh, being getting kicked out because they found out that I, was, had, mental, I had special needs. Uh, it has a lot of mental health issues and stuff. And I also had, well, the health issues, mental health is not that bad. I mean, it was bad, but it also is bad at the same time. And, uh, I had a stomach issue. And I, I would, every now and again, some, uh, some liquid would fly out, uh, out of my stomach, which is normal. It's not normal for everybody, but in my case, in medical stuff, it's normal. I would have stains coming out and stuff. And, uh, they knew that it was my, they knew it was a medical thing. So they, they, uh, they, they didn't really address it. They, they knew that I couldn't really help that. And, uh. My, my, uh, my captain got really mad because <laughs> I didn't lie, but my parents lied for me, and that was, and it made me look bad, but at the same time, he, he understood that I really wanted to join the military, and he said that there's a chance for me to get in, and then there's a chance for me to not getting in, and that was back before I started taking medication. Now I'm on medication, not for special needs, but for uh, schizophrenia. And, uh, yeah. And Judge C it really did help me out. Um, it, <laughs> I was a really bad kid. I wasn't a bad kid, but everyone else looked at me as a bad kid. 
So I was like, you know what? I want to change. I want to join the military. I hear they straight people out. And uh, I thought I was going to boot camp. And it's not boot camp. They didn't do anything to me. <laughs> they didn't make me crazy or anything like that. I mean, don't get me wrong. There are some crazy cadets. And yes, they do make you go crazy. But it's not the same crazy as the actual military. It's all watered down. And everything's all nice and easy. If you think I'm lying, I'm not lying. I'm not trying to recruit you. I'm not a recruiter. I'm, I'm telling you from my perspective of how it is. Um, the only time they ever raise your voice is if you did something wrong. Uh, <laughs> and... That's about it. Me, I never had that issue. I, I was always the, I was always known as the good kid or whatever compared to the rest of them. So, yee! Which I have my own shenanigans. <laughs> Everybody has shenanigans at one point in time in about during service. So, yeah, it's okay, especially when you're first starting out. So there's there's bound to be some shenanigans. Which is the reason why they don't give the uniform out the back. You have to earn the rank. And then get your uniform at the same time. But sometimes you still get the uniform. Well, actually, no, not sometimes. Actually, you get the uniform even if, if you don't get the rank. Because, <clears throat> excuse me, the only time you get the rank is if you've made all, like, three days in all your classes. Which... Because of special needs and stuff, I have it easier. So, because of that, I still pass. Um, so, yay. <sighs> Um, other folks were not so lucky. I met cadets who, who didn't get to, get, get to make the ranks. And they were pretty upset about it. I'm like, hey, it's okay, you can try out. You, I always gave them hope. And it doesn't matter what I did. It made it a lot worse. <laughs> so, best thing to do is just don't brag about your ranks. Oh, hey, look at me! That's an example. Look at me, I'm a good dick sergeant. Woohoo! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you can say that you're a good dick sergeant, you just can't go ahead and, bla and brag about your ranks and flex. <laughs> yeah, don't. <laughs> Woo. And we had some crazy good ads. I did. <laughs> I did that. But it was a different thing. It was a different scenario. <laughs> I was stupid. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was pretty stupid. <laughs> I mean, I knew, I knew better, but then there are times where I, it, it, it's funny. The, the mistakes have made, made to me laugh now. It's not funny then, but it's funnier now. And it's, and I wish I could go back to that. I'll, I'll miss that day. But at the same time, if I stayed in the past, I wouldn't be here making YouTube videos for you guys. And I, and I enjoy it. I enjoy talking to people about drugs you see and stuff. That's the reason why I created YouTube. Uh, it gives me... It gives me a light where people can hear my story and... Um, and learn at the same time. 
and have more knowledge. And here's another thing. All units are different. Just because I talk about my unit the way we ran it, they may not run it the same way. They may run it a different way now. They may be wearing different uniforms. When I got out, they all wore different uniforms. The rules and regulations stay the same, but the uniform stuff changes. So I don't know what, I mean, for all I know, they're going to run out with turquoise. Turquoise, um, turquoise uniforms. Dress blues will remain the same, but the OCPs and all that other stuff may change as well. I don't know. I don't know how it works. What I do know is, is that whatever you do, do not impersonate actual military guys. Keep the jersey uniform. And, and remain judge the uniform. Uh, you know, stay there. Don't don't be like the other guys with their uniforms. If there's anything I, I that you guys want me to cover on, please let me know down in the comments below. I would love to make more videos um, for you guys. Um, the other thing is I wanted to add is they won't make you change, but they request you for you to change. There, no lie, don't steal, don't cheat, no other time I guess who does. And we take that thing, we take the lying thing seriously. And we, in my unit, we were pretty hardcore about it. And again, it also depends on the flight. I mean, the only rule I would say is that you can lie to your friends and stuff, but you can't lie to them. And even then, I wouldn't lie to anybody because they can file a, a, a complaint. But... If you're at said dread to see, they, there's nothing they can do to you. Uh, there's nothing they can do. So, all I'm saying is, is just be careful. Keep your eyes out. Don't do anything stupid. You should be fine. Um, anyway, thanks. If there's anything else I could cover, please let me know down in the comments below. And let me know about your units. How does your units work? You know, I'm really am interested. Um, and I would, I and mean, I would actually share that story with you guys about other units and stuff if you guys want me to. If you ask me not to share about it, then fine, I won't share. But there's just certain things I can and can't speak about on YouTube. So see you guys later.